What's up everybody, Landry here with a commentary. I have a video sent in by HK Juicy Fruit, a sank flag game that goes the full 15 against a couple well-known names. So just sit back and let's check it out. Capture the flag. He's going to start off by pushing his jump up right now. Pushes into ring two. Unfortunately, the other team gets rockets first and blows him away. Spawns on his rock ramp right now. Puts a couple shots on Kidbo. He is able to dodge the rocket. Makes his way to that health rock. Jumps back into health and unfortunately is destroyed by the guys coming into support. Spawns on his court right now. He's able to put a couple shots on Freezing Cicada. He is able to pick him up with their pillars. Gets hit with a couple nades. Shields are low. He's going to push his way back through his shotgun until those shields are charged. Makes his way back up to his street. He is able to pick up a pit bull in their court. Sees a guy at the opposing health pack, so he sends a nade over. Makes his way to their jump up. Looking across, he's got a two-on-one across the map. Not a very good situation, so he's going to put himself in a better angle to where they can't see him. Two of his teammates go down at their base, so he's going to make his way back to their street right now. Sees a guy, puts a couple shots on Cicada, but unfortunately gets out to Yamarn. At his rock ramp once again, looking around, sees that a couple of teammates went down. He is able to put some shots on the guy as he drops the blob, and he is able to clean him up. Makes his way up the hunt ramp right now, gets a beat on Kidbo. Does get the assist. Health is low right now, so he's kind of staying away from anything that might hit him, using those pillars for cover. His shields do come up. He is able to pick up T-squared as he drops to his court. Unfortunately, the double team at the opponent's jump up is too much for him. Spawns in his rocks right now. Picks up the sticky grenades at his Walshi. Looking at the opposing hunt right now. Sees Freezing Cicada. His first nade doesn't go too far. He is able to pick up the assist. Fortunately, T-squared pushes him at his carbine and is able to take him out. He's going to spawn in his court right now. Gives a little revenge. Helps his teammate take out T-squared on his street. He's going to pick up the fresh rockets at ring one. Makes his way to ring two. Doesn't see anybody in the rocks. He does see his teammate put a couple shots on somebody on their street. So his teammate plays smart. Backs up. Baits the guy to ring three where he Juicy Fruit's able to clean him up. Sees another guy at their window. Cleans him up. Frantically reloads these rockets. He's one shot. He does go down, but he's able to pick up the double kill. And his teammate's able to pick up those rockets to get another kill. Spawns in his rocks right now. Makes his way. He is able to clean up T-squared across the map, grabs that flag. They do spawn in their court, so he's not going to get far, but that little bit of distance is able to pay off for his team later. He's at his turret right now, picks up that jetpack. He is able to pick up Snipe right off the spawn. Gets a body shot and the no-scope on T-squared. He looks to his bond and picks up Kidbo for the double kill and allows his team to go up 1-0 early. Gets a body shot on Sinkeda, throws a nade, pushes their street right now. He is able to pick up the assist. He's looking around. He knows there's a guy at their hut somewhere. Does get the nice snipe on squared as he pushes under their turret. Gets the double kill on Pitbull and the rocks. He sees another guy. Gets the sick triple with the sniper spree, but he's unable to get the angle on the guy at rock ramp for the overkill. Drops down underneath their turret right now, just kind of making sure they don't spawn court. I believe they Flag do. One taken. guy makes it all the way to their jump rock already, Flag and another guy pushes rock. into their hut. Misses the snipe, throws an aid, but it doesn't do too much. T-square drops down and cleans them up at their shotgun. Flag. He's going to spawn in his rocks right now. He sees some shots coming from an opposing player at his health rock. They run away. He drops down to Blob and picks him up with a beat down. He does see a guy at their pillars right now. Probably calling for some help right now. Fortunately, doesn't get it. In this situation, I probably would have stayed back, let that shield come back. There's nothing wrong with hiding. It would have kept him alive, probably. Uh, gave his teammates time to come help, but unfortunately, he gets ballsy and it doesn't pay off. He's going to spawn in his rocks again. Puts a couple shots on T squared at the opposing wall. He's also taking shots from around his health. The guy drops to main ramp. He's looking for him. He does see the guy at his health. Misses the assassination. Luckily, he had a friend there, a teammate there, to help him with the team shot. He's one shot right now, kind of just hanging low. Sees a guy at ring one, just using those pillars to block any line of sight that he might get from him. He does pick up that jetpack, and once again, he's there for the sniper spawn. He's going to jetpack to ring three, see if he can't see anybody. He misses a couple snipes right here on Kid, though. He's going to drop down to their car. 
one shot right now. He needs to play it safe, not do too much. He is keeping a look just in case he's able to get a shot off. He is not able to get a shot right there. Gets a nice body shot on the guy at his wall. He's going to pick him up at ring one. Gets another nice body shot and another one to get this kill on Pitbull. He has one shot right now trying to stay alive, but unfortunately he gets picked off at ring one by Kippo. He's going to spawn in the rocks again. He makes his way to that carbine rock and pushes up onto his car street. He's going to go ahead and drop back down, probably get some pullouts. And well placed nade, picks up the guy reloading at his pillars. He does go down from the guy at his jump up. The opposing team gets a pull, but luckily his teammates stop him before he's ever even needed. Picks up that jet pack. Pushes onto his P Street right now. Misses the ring three landing, but he is able to pick up T squared at their street. His teammate seems to be taking shots from their health. He's looking across the map. Unfortunately, he gets spawned on in their rocks and is picked up by the double team. Taken. Lay. Spawns Wrong. under their turret right now, pushes back up to their street, gets a nice little kill there. Unfortunately, his other two teammates went down. He picks up the double kill on Pitbull. He's also to pick up the pure DMR triple kill on Cicada, but unfortunately T-squared ends that quick. He's going to spawn in his court right now, slowly making his way to that jump up. He's going to put shots on Kibbo out of the air, drops him from the jetpack. Fortunately, he gets taken one shot at their jump up, tries to get away, but is cleaned up by Squared once again. Spawns in his hut right now. He starts to push a streak going to ring two, but T-Squared says not today. He spawns, grabbing that jetpack once again. Decides he's going to go back to ring two, even though his try was cut short last time. Kidbo right now with the sniper. Luckily, he has help from his team. He is able to turn, throws a nice nade. Unfortunately, Kidbo gets a pretty good hiding spot at his wall, and Kidbo's teammate is able to pick him up. He's going to spawn in his hut right now, looking around. He sees Pitbull at their carbine, putting a couple shots on, hopefully getting some help from his team. He's going to push up a little bit to that street. Grabs the pistol here just to have another weapon, just in case. He's at his wall with his teammates that have rockets and a sniper, so they're in a pretty good position holding ring two. He's taking shots from the opposing rock position. Pushes their bond, grabs that sniper. He's getting shot, so he tries to run away quick. He's one shot right now, just kind of hanging out in his bond until his shields come back. Does take T squared one shot again in their bond. Unfortunately, he's able to get picked up at his jump up from the opposing court. Spawns under turret once again. He hears that snipe come up, so he's going to grab it. Pushes to ring three to see if he can see anything. Gets a shot on squared, exchanging. Fortunately, he goes one shot. He's trying to stay alive. Unfortunately, that nade just takes him out. Less than five minutes here. He picks up Pitbull. Nice call out from a teammate as he cleans him up at his rock ramp. Picks up the sniper again at the opposing pillars. His team gets a touch on the flag. He is able to... Uh, his teammate actually drops Kidbo right there. He is able to hit Pitbull. Unfortunately, his teammate got the kill before him. He's going to get a nice kill on Cicada here finally. Jumps to their street. He's looking to see what he can do to help his team out. Gets a nice kill on T-squared right there. Snipe off the turret. Just holding the position right now. Making sure nobody comes out that he might be able to clean up. Looking in the rocks right now. He's got a good position with that sniper. Sees another guy at the turret. He misses that shot. He's pushing their wall. Makes his way back to their street right now. Drops down to their jump up. Misses the first shot but lands the second on Kibbo at their hut ramp. He's going to make his way to their health pack right now. At their flag right now, helping his teammate <laughs> take out Pipple in their hut. He knows they're spawning rocks right now. He puts a couple nice shots on Kibbo, as well as a nice little juke right here to get the beat down on him. Gets the killing spree. He's absolute right now. He grabs that health pack to bring his shields back up. Puts a couple shots on the guys at their jump up. Unfortunately, there's two of them. With the help of his teammate, he picks up squared right here. He's taking some shots from behind. Sitting tight at the help, jump up, makes it to ring two to kind of get a higher position. Stop taking so many shots. Helps his teammate pick up the kill in ring one. Puts another, gets another nice kill on their bond. Puts a couple shots at the guy at their street. Makes it to ring two. Pushes back to their street for the flank. Unfortunately, that guy's gone now. Drops down to ring one and T-squared takes his head off with a nice no scope. gonna spawn at his health pack right now less than three minutes to go 
It's going to push into their ring two right now. Throwing nades at their hut from their street. Helping KC out any t t way he can. Makes his way to their window right now. Drops down, puts a couple shots on Cicada. Picks up that sniper, puts it to work. No more Cicada. Gets another nice kill on Pitbull from their turret. Nobody else seems to be in sight. Jumps up to ring two. Misses the shot on Kidbo. Gets the sick no scope the second time as he kills him out of their bond, even though he goes down. A very nice play to get the guy out of their bond. He's going to spawn in their hut right now. Unfortunately, Sinkeda's not going to go too far as his team stopped that flag. There's another guy at their jump up, but he seems to be taken care of. He's going to push to the opposing jump up right now. Try to see if they can't shift the momentum really quickly. He jumps up to ring two, puts some shots on the guy at their jump up. T squared jumps back into ring two. He is able to pick up T squared. Unfortunately, he falls as he's reloading to the opposing player. He's going to spawn in their court right now. Jumps up to hut. Grabs that sniper again. He's been doing some pretty good things with it this game. Jumps up to ring three. He's looking around. He's at their bond right now. Remain. He hears some shots coming from his carbine. His teammate's able to pick him up. He's able to uh, win this nice little sniper battle with Kidbo with a very nice snipe close quarters. He's going to jump up to ring two. Looking at their streak. Gets a nice body shot on the guy. T squares also in the court. Plays it smart and backs down. Tries to stay alive. He's in ring one. Still really weak. Kidbo goes down at their turret and his team grabs the flag. Unfortunately, he goes down at their main ramp, but his flag gets a very nice flag pull here at the end. They get the nice flag cap to pretty much secure this game. He's going to kind of come in and grab these rockets, just add some insult to injury if he can, put a little salt in the wound with these rockets after the timer runs out. It's going to be a 2-0 finish for Juicy Fruit and his crew. I'd like to give a big shout out to Juicy Fruit fruit for the nice video as always i'm langy if you'd like your gameplay commentated just be sure and message me on xbox live instructions and gamer tag will be in the description follow me on twitter at mlg it's langy and catch under the radar 411 every monday at 9 p.m eastern on twitch.tv thanks guys and i'll catch you later